Hey guys, this is Tyler from T50 Central, and I am so excited to be saying this, but this is my first official Sims 3 LP. I have tried to record this LP three times over the past, I think, year, maybe even two years. I finally found some software that recorded the Sims 3, and I'm so friggin' excited. Um, I actually just fi filmed the first part of this video. But that was with the old software, so it was messed up. So I will be filming the first part again, and it's actually it's fine because my game ended up crashing. So, you know, it was not meant to be. Um, so, like I said, I'm Tyler from TVG Central, and I know you were like, but you do, like, vlogs and stuff like that. Well, I was, like, I've always loved gaming and stuff like that, so I, this is something I'm very passionate about, and I feel like if I did something like this, I would upload more frequently. Um, a little bit about, like, me like who i am who i admire the most like in the gaming community would probably be um live simmer she actually got me into youtube i was searching like what comes with the sims 3 generations one time and um she like she popped up so i like i started watching her videos and i was like instantly hooked like i loved her voice her personality so she's one of my top favorite youtubers and definitely like my favorite gamer youtube and then I also love K-pop because she's just wacky, crazy, like, um, Christina is, like, so serious, and then K-pop's, like, so, like, that, that bitch is crazy. Like, you know, like, she makes, like, crazy decisions. I love it. And then, like, kind of, like, I'm gonna say hybrid. Like, and then, like, like, I know he's really into them, but I recently just discovered Nick Dominates, and that's a crusty hoe right there, JK. Um, he's become one of my favorites, like, super, super fast, because he's very funny, like, he can be serious if he wants to, but I just love, like, his videos, like, such a funny character. And then, um, I also really like Joey, I like both his, um, gaming videos and also, like, you know, his regular content, so my favorite, like, one of my first YouTubers to really get into, so, like, those are, like, my, probably my favorite YouTubers, like, gaming and not, well, they're all gamers, but Joey's more so, like, both, you know. So, um. <laughs> let me get to the lp why don't i like just talk about myself so our sims name is athena valencia she um her lifetime wish is to be a great explorer and i'll give you some backstory on that so she is adventurous she has photographer's eye she's a savvy sculptor she's a hopeless romantic and she's hydrophobic and she's she's a virgo her favorites are autumn salad pop music and the color yellow and I just found her name, like, I'm um, doing the role thing, you know, and create a sim. And then Athena popped up, and I was like, oh, I like that. I want her to have something kind of, like, out like out there, like, very unique. And then Valencia, I did the last name, and, like, that popped up. And I was like, oh, that's very, very cute. And it's, um, it reminded me of travel, because she's going to be a traveler. Like, that's how I envision her, traveling to different countries. So I want her name to be kind of, like, associated with that. Like, it's very, very out there, um, kind of exotic, um... But also, like, when um, Valencia popped up, I was reminded of Lysimer Sim Valentina, and I was like, okay, this is the perfect fit. And then, so she's kind of your, um, jack of all trades. Like, I, I got, I, she's kind of like a normal person. Like, I know all Sims are not all Sims, but she is somebody, like, you would meet off the street, you know? Like, she's kind of, like, she likes to travel a lot. Like, she's not, like, a super, she's not, like, a witch, like, anything. I mean, tr you can tell she's not a witch, but you know what I mean? Like, she's not, like extra special or anything like she's she's basic no but um like some of her backstory like i think of her becoming this person who wants to travel and explore is because she had a near-death experience in her past she almost drowned and this caused her to like want to face danger like head on and make new challenges and overcome them but she still has a fear of water thing that she's hydrophobic so i think it'd be interesting if she comes across like any water during her travels i think that'd be really cool um the last video actually because she wanted to be in the architecture career but it's like uh, so i decided that she should be an investigator because she just she has she, she's nosy she wants to be a traveler explorer so why does she not like explore mysteries and such so we're going to go get her job and she also lived um we're in evansdale county that is a custom content world sorry i'm in my bed being really loud that, so that's a custom oh god that's a custom content world so um 
I had like the expansion installed, but I don't know if I did it right, so I just uninstalled that, whatever. But um, she was in an apartment, and I actually decided I was like, you know, I was like, let's well, just move her in a house. Like, there's no need for that apartment. This like this came like the apartment didn't come furnished, and she barely had any money left. And then she still has four hundred forty six dollars. So we're gonna go get the job, do a few cases, we get her, can get her a computer, and then we will like make some leeway. The first few parts of this is gonna be awkward. I'm just gonna let you know, like, I'm more together right now than I was in the last part, but I'm really excited for this LP, and, um, oh god, oh, I gotta turn the music off, okay, I'm gonna put it on mute, because, I don't, th I don't know, you guys, you're gonna just be hearing my voice, I guess, I'm sorry that it annoys you, <laughs> but I don't wanna get copyright, okay, I ain't got time for that. So she is, um, it kind of sucks, because I did like her living in town, but it is what it is, right? But recently I've been playing, um, an Isla Paradiso, and I have a lot of custom content and stuff, so it's kind of nice not having so much lag, because I never realized, um, that that place had a lot of lag, because, one, the town itself, but then, I mean, of course, the custom content and stuff, on top of that, like, my game isn't unplayable there, thankfully, but it is slower compared to this, like, I always like starting a new game because it's so clean, so uncluttered, but then once you get in, it's like, ugh. So we are going to join the investigator career. And, um, I guess I really, I really like her because she is, she's kind of like spunky, I guess you would say. Like, she's, she's feminine. But she has like a little tomboy in her like she's more so on the girly side but she like can get dirty when she wants to um oh I need to change next off camera I'm gonna change the um settings for the weather and stuff because I I don't like the whole week thing I'm like you have longer times so I'm thinking Evansville County maybe fall would be longer and I can't tell about winter because this it has like a city part it has a uh, farming area and then it also has like a suburbs i'm pretty sure so i would think like there would be i don't know like it's a lot of different times so i'm thinking you know farming like we're gonna have longer fall maybe um my least favorite um time on this game like it's beautiful but it i feel like it just slows the game down so much it would be winter okay so she got her first case actually maybe why don't i just for we can have some sound just turn the music off like maybe that would be smart like i said um that's kind of like if i'm if i'm awkward i feel like i say that in every fucking video um yeah i cuss a lot so i'm so sorry for that so sorry so where the hell is this sound? okay wow it's right here we're going to mute the music because I don't sometimes I don't like playing like you know a quiet oh god that's so loud a quiet game like it kind of bugs me and that's gonna be really loud I'm sorry because my speaker is like up really high um I'm just, what was I doing oh, yeah we need to get a, a case that is so loud Let me see if I can turn that down a little bit. I'm sorry for... Like I said, this first part is going to be a little rough. <laughs> I apologize for that. Ambient. I don't know what that is. Let's do that. Yeah, that brought it down some. That's good. That's good. Oh, God. That's loud. And it sucks because she had actually met some people last episode. But I'm actually going to place a lot of my own people in town because, one, they're more pretty. <laughs> I'm just teasing. But um, I like having some of, like, you know, your own characters. I feel like it adds some more, um, it makes, it spices things up. Because you're like, oh, like, I know this person. Like, you know, they have their own personalities and stuff. So I think that's, that's cool sometimes. But, but yeah, I, I really, really do love her outfit. I will probably actually make her like um, an adventure outfit like so when she goes to like different countries and it's funny because the last time I think I started out she wanted to go to Egypt I think maybe France but this time she wanted to go to China and I was like that was the place I plan on taking her first because I feel like oh god here's the mascot 
Oh, at least we can sell the time machine for money because it should spawn at our house. But, um, what was I saying? But I feel like France is a place, like, you know, you would go on vacation, just, like, relax, stuff like that. Yay, it's been on our house. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you for the money. And then, um, oh, if you hear that, that is not the purge bell, but my town has a curfew bell, and it goes off at, like, 9 o'clock, which is a little lame. But anyways, when I have, like, people over, they're like, oh my god, what was that? And I'm like, it's not the purge, you calm down, it's okay. <laughs> but anyway, sorry. I felt, I feel like France is, like, a place, oh my goodness. We don't have a computer, okay, we have to go to, we have to go to the library. Because this girl does not have a computer. Um, what is the library here? I think it's like where she. Oh, that's not where she lives. Hello, well, it's the library over here. Oh, the library is in town, I guess. And um, okay. You guys are probably thinking, it's like right there. Oh, yep. Yeah. There we go. But anyways, I feel like France is just like a vacationing place. And China like has, I feel like China is a place you would go on vacation, but also where you can do like exploring, learn some skills, martial arts, and all that jazz. And then Egypt is like extreme. So I really want her to travel to Egypt and China a lot and maybe like once she, like she'll go to France but maybe like it'll be more so like when she gets older and has a family. I think she'll have a family. That would be like a while. I'm thinking maybe going the route of may it'd be really cool. Maybe she, oh no, I was saying actually I was saying when I first filmed I'm gonna add some people in because she's kinda like basically we're gonna say that she's like Serena Vanderwoodson. Oh, actually, no, damn it, no. Oh, wait, no, actually, this is perfect. This is perfect. She's like Serena Vanderwoodson. She just came home. Like, we're gonna say she just came home from boarding school. And then, like, she has, like, her friends throughout the city. So that would be awesome. Like, I'm gonna make, like, it's not gonna be, like, you know, a gossip girl for real, but, like, that would be so much fun. Ew, okay, girl. We get it. You sneezing. Calm your tits. Calm your tits. Okay, so she's gonna go report her findings. But yeah, I was like, you know, I was like, she could be like Gossip Girl or some shit like that. Um, I'm so, oh man, I'm so excited. Dickie. What was I saying before? Dickie. But I'm going to save my game real fast, so I will be right back. Okay, I am back and we are filling that case. But oh my goodness, guys. Oh my goodness. <laughs> if I could speak, I'm so sorry. But she solved her first case. Um, okay, girl. She's going shopping or whatever. Ooh, she has pretty hair. Who are you? Ooh, okay. What's her name? Jamie. Oh girl, get us this nectar. We need to drink and drink and drink. But oh, do you guys like listen to Banks? Because oh my god. Like I've listened to her. I I think I got on her like during my junior year of high school. And I've recently been like, getting back into her. My faves right now are Brain Fall Over. Waiting game. There's so much. Drowning will always be one of my favorites. Alibi, same for that. And, um, yeah, that's probably my tops right now. And then my first song to hear by Banks was You Should Know Where I'm Coming From. Iconic. So we are going to get another case, actually. And I am sorry that it's just so slow, the first few parts. But I kind of, like, want to build up her money a little bit. Oh, yeah, we can get... Oh, yeah. I forgot. We can get, like, we can go to the library to get a case. That will save us time from, like, going all the way to the police station until we can get our own computer. Like, it'll be soon. It won't be long. Computers, I think, are, like, I think we could get one right now, actually. But I want to do 
maybe one more case, two more cases, and then we can get our computer, and then, um, yeah. So I want to get her kind of settled in at home before we start adventuring. So this isn't going to be an exclusive World Adventures LP. It's going to be kind of more like of an all-in-one, I'm guessing. Um, I don't know to what extent it will be an all-in-one because I do want to do LPs like specifically because I think I have... I'm pretty sure I have every expansion pack. I don't have every stuff pack, and I do not have a lot of the um, store content, but I, I'm pretty sure I have every expansion pack. If you hear anything, that's like my sister watching TV in the living room. So, um, whoever is watching this video, which I doubt anyone is, Go and comment in the bottom who your favorite YouTuber is, and I will message. Well, you guys already know, but, you know, I'll tr like, interact and try to talk like a normal person. This video, I think, is probably going to be 25 to 30 minutes. I know that's kind of long, but I, f I don't know. I feel like sometimes, like, I hate it when, like, someone has a video... Like, sometimes, like, sometimes it's nice, like, when you have a 15-minute video, but, I like, when you have, like, a lot of stuff that you can watch. But then I know sometimes it can be kind of boring, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> so, I don't want to bore anybody. Girl, what is you blowing over here? We don't do drugs. Ew, Sherry, stop it. <laughs> Discuss accusation with Jasmine Romos. Okay, let's go find Jasmine. I I do like the investigator career. I like um it allows you to meet a lot of new people very early on if like you know your character doesn't know anybody. Actually, instead of your actually you can tell me your favorite YouTuber, but also leave in the comments um maybe like your favorite sim to create like your maybe like your favorite style. Of playing the game like are you more um, family oriented are you more drama like you know what I mean like are you more like nightlife stuff like that like I'm a person where I used to be very into like I've had two kind of like different like different elements in my sim elements I, mean, I don't know like different like chapters in my sims career I guess you would say like I went through a time where I really liked the whole um city scene oh, reporting the chuck at the time where i was really into like the whole city thing and then there was a time when i was really into the whole generations kind of ordeal and then i went through like a supernatural um and then i kind of like right now i'm like my current household is kind of like a blend of oh wait no my bad then i went to a sh showtime like a show it was supposed to be a showtime expansion pack actually and they they're so they were so much fun to play with like i'll play my sims months on months on months like it's ridiculous so they were so much fun like very different personalities it's funny to see who ended up with who um that was a lot of fun like i had to show you guys them sometime that was a lot of fun so then i think after that i started playing a um i think it was after that i started a kind of island par the isla paradisa family and they they've been one of my favorite families like they've been a lot of fun and there's kind of like they have been more generations slash what would i say they've just I, I guess you could say they've been a generations but more so kind of like whatever i want to do with them they've just been they've just been that family like you know Ooh, whatever we want to do i was like i want to get into island paradise because i feel like i haven't explored that as much as i should have and i guess a lot of them i just saw diddy's photo at the agency and how to pick him up oh i'm sorry i had story progression on by the way okay so we have five hundred dollars that's like the only annoying thing about it We're actually going to get a picture taken while we're here. Might as well. We look hot, so. Yeah, I think we sh we Okay, so before this part, part ends, we are going to get a promotion. 
She wants to go roller skating. Can we do that here? I'm sorry if I sound like a noob. I think um I'm excited to do LP like an LP two because I feel like it kind of forces you to try new things in the game. And you know, cause sometimes I'm not gonna like sometimes the Sims can get dry, but I think that it just all depends on kind of like your mood and your creativity, like what, how far you want to go. So if you if you try to, I feel like pursue new things and stuff like that, open yourself up, then new things will happen. But if you if you just play this way, the way you always have, like I'm like that's fine. But I find like the game gets a little bit more dry. Then okay, we'll answer our phone. Goodness. But like, you have seven days. Seven days till what? Till you fucking die. Okay, girl, answer your phone, honey. She is so cute. Oh, shit. I guess they hung up. Um, we're not a psychic, so we can't do... Like, that, um, that's a glitch, actually. Like, I, I read, like, that's a glitched, um, opportunity. We're actually going to go eat... And I will also add some different venues around the town if I can find space. Like I said, I want to do a lot with this town. It has a lot of potential. It's a very, very, it's a very cool town, I believe. I've played in it a little bit, but I haven't really gotten to really get a full, full, like, hands-on experience with this town. Because, like, my old computer, my sims always crash, so. And then this, I, I don't know, I never really, ex I don't know why I didn't explore. But, oh yeah, this is her formal wear. Um, I'll show you guys later. I'm sorry for yawning. I haven't even done anything. I've been watching Joey's videos and then I was watching some 90210. If any fellow fans out there, yes. So, like I said, I, I, it's gonna be an all in one thing. So, we're gonna see her at different areas of her life. So one, you know, some some segments she'll be adventuring, and then other segments she might be going to bars, and then others she might like be giving birth to children. Who knows? Oh, speaking of which, like my current household, um, ugh, I need I have got to do a current hospital. Like I'll do that in time, but um, they had two like two like one of the couples like they had two kids, and I something was just like. Somebody's just telling me like they needed to adopt a child, so I ended up adopting. And I was like, it was really cool. Um, that kid's at um, born in school right now, but you know, some like I really like I haven't really adopted many kids in The Sims, and I don't know. It was just something was telling me like you know, adopt this child, adopt this child. So I did, and it's like I enjoy having them in the house. She's so pretty. So we're gonna actually go go home go to sleep and then in the morning we will get a new case solve it and then i will end this part here i think off screen i will sorry I keep changing my whole voice off screen i'm going to add some sims in oh she wants to move into a high-rise building like maybe eventually but like i said right now like i think this house is fine for her she pro she's probably for a while she will be here but there's not really any point in getting like a hella nice house right away if she's not going to be home. But, like this is actually a decent house. It has two bedrooms and two bathrooms. So she's not like, it's not a bad house. So she's going to eat some waffles. But like I said, I was like, I, I've never really adopted children. So it's just really, I don't know, something's just telling me. I need to adopt a child because like i'm a person where i'm like okay this sim is only gonna have one kid and they normally end up having like three sometimes four so um but like her sister like the sim sister that adopted her she only has one child and i was like i'm sticking to it like like i had to tell you because she is it oh she's one of my favorite sims like i've ever had she's been so she's been such a blast to play with they're actually both like because they're sisters and they're both actually one of them's an elder one of them's an adult she just turned into an adult so one of the sisters are married one of them like that girl's been around so she's kind of like settling down like she's found the guy for her and then the older sister like i said has three kids so then her oldest is a teen and then her second born he is now a teenager as well the first one is a girl and then the third, um, the one that they adopted, she is a child, and she is, like I said, at boarding school right now. And then the um, younger sister, she has a son who is also a teenager. 
he and the um he and his cousin the the girl cousin the teenager they were born around the same time so it's an interesting dynamic they all live in the same house so sometimes it gets a little crazy but i do like having a lot of sims in one house like i feel like it depends on the gameplay you're playing sometimes it's annoying and tiresome but other times it's really cool to have like all those different personalities like with this lp i'm thinking we will probably have maybe three or four i can't decide if I, I think i want her to have maybe like a best friend live with her i don't know she might just live with whoever she ends up dating we will find out but she's gonna be sleeping for a while and i guess i'll just keep talking you guys like i'm sorry that i've been more so oh let me talk about myself but i feel like you know it's nice to get to know people and such and um but you know in time we will be focusing more on the sim and her antics do they i don't understand why they don't put sinks and like that bugs me i don't oh that just that annoys me so we're gonna actually buy her a sink real fast i don't like that though because it's like i need a sink here come on we're gonna make a new counter real fast i don't know will one even fit here it should oh no oh that sucks i, I could do move objects but i don't feel like it so we're gonna just i am so sorry again oh I've actually like, got my sleeping schedule like, back on track because I was going to bed at like 5 in the morning. No, actually later than that. And it was ridiculous. So I've got my schedule back on track. I'm trying to go like around 12. And I, it's really nice because I'm like, I'm not sleeping and I feel a bit more productive. So it's, it's really nice. We're going to get a cheap desk. We don't really even need a desk. But it's whatever. I'm actually going to put it at this angle. And I actually like the color scheme of this house. We could get that. Mm, I'd rather get the laptop because then she could take it wherever she wants. And I feel like it would be more helpful with her invest. Oh, God. $40. $40. Oh, that is, that's tragic, honestly. That is, oh, really? We couldn't even get this cute chair? Okay. Oh, oh well, we don't even need it. Oh, yeah, I'll just get a chair. <sighs> That's so embarrassing. So, yeah, she is literally broke. Okay. Oh, we have a gnome. Oh, yeah, okay. Thank you, Mr. Gnome. So, she is um an art school graduate, by the way. Um, That's pretty cool. And this episode might be longer because like i said we will we will end this episode once she gets a promotion so if it's longer than 30 minutes i'm sorry but this i guess actually would be my first like not my first lp but i am going to be committed to this lp because i've done this one called death code and i might try to bring it back i'm not sure it's not like it was it's popular or anything but I might bring it back. I don't know. I might just cut it because it's been like a year since I've uploaded that. And I think maybe with this software, I might actually be... Oh my... Okay. I'm either going to... I think I'm going to record Dragon Age because Jade... I really do like Jade Empire, but I feel like I can make a better LP out of Dragon Age if that makes sense. Um... I feel like I know it more. Like I'm more comfortable with it. Like I like Jade Empire, but I haven't, f I haven't finished it yet. And I know you're probably thinking, but you already have Jade Empire LP. Yeah, but it got messed up. The audio got really messed up, and that. So I'm sorry about that. But I think I, I would really, really like to. Um, something like something with CC really fucked the cats up on this game. Like they. <laughs> but oh, random cyber who. <laughs> But I would really, really like to do a Dragon Age LP. Because I have both number one and number three. So I would have to get number two if I did that. Because I would love to do a series of it. And one day I would actually like to do a Mass Effect. But I've never played Mass Effect on PC. So that would like get some taking, getting used to. But okay, you like me. <clears throat> actually, actually, oh damn, I gotta just search for the case. So she's gonna search for the case, take a shower. 
and go do the case. It is raining out here. Girl, don't get electrocuted. We're actually gonna check the weather. Even though, like, we clearly know it's raining. But these are her PJs. I think they're really cute, actually. Wait till you see her swimsuit. Like, her swimsuit is ho so hot. Like, she's a hottie patati with a body. And anybody with a body can wear a swimsuit. BT does. Anybody can be a hottie patati. Oh, this girl. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Ugh, I love her outfit. Like, I think my favorite part is, like, the Ritz um, stockings with the boots. I just feel like they make the outfit. Because I was like, I think I was like, oh, do these go together? But, like, they really do. Like, I think it's really, really cute. What? I thought, I okay. I thought I told her to take a shower, but that's fine. She's just gonna smell like shit when she meets this person. Like, oh, I'm a private investigator, but, like, I smell like shit. Um, nice to meet you. I guess everybody just loves this carnival. Really? Really, huh? Get her fucking ass back here. Ew, she is. Ew, what is she wearing? Um, honey. What the fuck? Okay. Discuss accusation with Joel Cronin. We're gonna complete this case. And then I will be ending the part. So she is now a small claims investigator. Exciting, exciting. But maybe like eventually in the LP, I think it would be interesting maybe like to add her parents to town and stuff like that. Because I have, oh my goodness, goodness sake. Like I said, I have, we already did this case, but okay. I have the NROS and it allows you to, um, I don't, did I already talk about this? Uh, it allows you to change like relationships so you can like add like a family member, stuff like that. And I think that's really useful because, um, especially if you're moving people to different towns, you can add them back and make it so they're still feeling. I think that's just a really neat tool. And I really enjoy the, like, I sound like such a nerd. Like, I thought it was just, it, it blew my mind, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Okay. I think she's about to end this case after this. I know she's probably going to have to go back to that person. Oh, a rock. Oh, my goodness. Let's collect that. But out of my favorite LP, sorry, that's just one. I'm just think what my favorite LP would probably be. Report in. Mm. Oh my God! Someone has a spaceship. Okay. Hmm. I really, really enjoyed. I'll always like nightlife will always be one of my favorites because I think that was like that was like my second expansion pack I think or no actually World Adventures was my second but nightlife will always I probably see maybe nightlife in Showtime and then I do I love like Generations like added some more gameplay and stuff but I probably see night nightlife in Showtime because I feel like they like added a lot to the game like I love the whole with nightlife i like the whole con like i like being able to turn into a vampire i liked that and then i loved the acting thing like i was always into that oh we get a trophy so next episode we will go and collect the trophy and i will try to um add some more characters to the town and thank you guys for watching i'm sorry if i am not i don't even know what i'm saying but I will get better at speaking, I promise. Actually, I don't promise. But yeah, next part, we'll go get collect that prize. We'll do some more cases. I'll try. I'll add those people in so she'll have some more people to interact with. Get, like, the game going. Get things started. And until then, I will see you guys. And thank you for watching. Until next time, bye, guys.